friends and welcome back to our table um first things first this is for entertainment purposes only and it's just my opinion and nothing more um i would like to kind of put the message out there to the house and senate can you please update us on what is going on with the people in the cages at the border this is worrying me sick I just keep seeing the images of them crammed in those and if they're still in the cages you need to do something about it that's all I'm asking I'm not judging I'm not just do something about it but if they're out of the cages and in hotels or something can you show us can you tell us because I got this picture and it's not good of the last thing I saw so I'm just asking you can you can you let us know can you let us see because this is what we need by the way we need the good news we need to see oh okay what well, someone cares so <laughs> how about that <laughs> someone cares and that seems to be what what we're missing here um, it can't be President Trump no offense to anybody but we don't believe a word he says he, he's lied too much he's he's lost that ability to be able to tell us something and us take it and feel better and that's one thing we're missing and we as a nation not Republic, just everybody it, it, it's I think maybe the whole world is realizing we're in a situation we need each other please we need each other we need to be able to trust each other to lean on each other and all I'm asking is let us know if they're in a hotel if they're not get them in a hotel let's be decent about this and and Mitch McConnell start doing something start doing something you're the leader in the Senate lead please okay um, what I've decided that I'm going to do is I'm going to do a grand tableau and what I'm going to do is um, well I don't even know if you can really call it a grand tableau I will use all of the cards but what I'm trying to do is I want to see if we can see what's happening and when Trump leaves the problem is <clears throat> like if I say from April to November that never works out in the cards and I think that's why even the Lenormand confuses me because where does September stop and November start you know what I'm saying you can't even figure out you're just going and it kind of all starts to blend in and I don't know I want something that we can hang on to and feel good about and go okay that's 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 closer to win at least for what the cards tell me okay so I'm going to do it this way I'm going to use all of the cards. I really shouldn't call it a grand tableau because it's not going to be that. Um, but I am going to use all of the cards to try to figure out. Um, from April today, or from the beginning, all of April, to through all of May. Those, those two months, April and May. And then if there's nothing in there it'll tell me what's going on what we're going through if there's nothing in there about him resigning being arrested <laughs> you know or something in the way of him leaving then I go to June and July and I'll just do but I'm only gonna do two months at a time because 
that may help more even though I'm going to use all of the cards okay so just kind of bear with me friends this is going to be um, probably long and so I'll do as much as I can today and then I will leave them I will not pick them up or anything I'll leave them spread out and then come on tomorrow and I, we'll just keep doing that and and see what because I am now to the point I want to know when I, I we, we 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 need something you know and I'm not wishing anything bad but, but this president is not a good president I don't care what you say he's not a good president he's hurting us so it's just my opinion you know I'm not um can you tell me the months of April and May and does Trump leave his presidency what can we expect for the months April and May and does Trump leave his presidency what can we expect for the months of April and May and does Trump leave his presidency I hope I have enough room okay oh I forgot that which is why it's not a grant tableau even though I'm using all the cards you do an odd number so I'm doing five 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 across to make a row okay so the third row will be the divider between the end of April and the beginning of May I would much rather have used seven but I don't have the room for seven so I can't do that so I'm gonna do five and I'll explain it as I go on so and and that's not really a grand tableau even though I'm using all the cards also I will tell you the main man and the main woman are both in this deck because I'm not asking about a certain person I'm trying to figure out what's going to happen in these two months and so they'll both be in there but the main man will represent Trump okay and the main woman should represent his wife who would be Melania okay I hope y'all are doing okay y'all I know it's hard I I do I know it's <sighs> but we we just um we got to keep praying and we got to stay positive and we got to love each other. We just got to love and care and care, just care, you know. I don't know y'all may not have enough room. Well, it's going to be close. I think I am, though. Holy cow. Oh, my God. Yes. Thank you. Oh, let me move my little candle a little further over. Okay. 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 As I was stating, I think you can see about as good. I may try to angle you down more. Um. So we've got one, two, three, four, five, five rows. This third row. So this is April, right into the third row, which is the end of April, and we'll pick up the beginning of May, and the last two rows will be May. Okay? I'm just trying, like I said, I thought about doing a gram tableau, which is probably why that's what I called it. But I realized when I was laying them out and kind of going through, I thought, 
How do I know what month this is? You really don't. Because if you're reading across, okay, if you're reading across, well, like I have this from April to May. Okay. Well, where does April end and May begin? With the grand tableau, it was even worse. So I don't know if I'm not understanding. Becca would probably understand that and be the one to. <laughs> um, so I decided the way I would do it is do the odd numbers because a lot of times that's what you do with other decks. I think only, I, I think, I don't know, I'm not positive, but I believe it's only the Kipper and the Lenormand decks that you even do a grand tableau. So everybody else, when you were doing and wanted to use all the cards because you want to get everything and know everything, you did the odd number. So you would either do five. You can't do it if you're doing four because there's no odd number in there to separate. So you could either do five. Usually I like to do seven because it just gives you a little more information, but five is fine. So the third row becomes the end of April. I know what ha what when that ends and the beginning of May. I hope you're you're following and I hope you're patient with me <laughs> because um, this is probably going to be more than and like I said it may take a couple of days but I, I, we need to know something y'all. We we do. Okay, so I have the lovers and the unexpected income and the pathway now as you notice I'm gonna stop here because I'm this is all gonna be about April what's already gone on and what will continue to go on and then I'll go that way for the other two to read on May okay so we have the lovers unexpected income light being shown okay some kind of Judith can okay let me do it this way the, the lovers okay the lovers unexpected income so this the lovers would be partners of Trump's unexpected income which just means money coming up that they shouldn't have could have to do with money laundering or something like that. The pathway at the end, the light is shown. So it, it reveals, okay? This is now the end of April. Okay. Some kind of judification, which is um, some kind of legal thing. It looks like it's about the money the main male Trump expectation so he's expecting something the end of April okay and you'll see me do this again for the beginning of May because that third row is gonna be the end of April also the beginning of May um, despair. Now this feels to me like it's everybody, y'all. It's everybody. And, um, the thief. So, the despair is going to come from the feeling of something being stolen from you. Now, while I'm at this, let me say that this is feeling, it's not just the virus, y'all. It's the despair of there's no money, of food, what, how do we eat? This is actually starting to, 
it's not starting to it is it's really standing out above everything it's their inability and remember that this started with unexpected income so if the people see Trump getting money from places he shouldn't get it while they are losing money or don't have money because they can't go to work or they can't do something you know there this becomes a very visual thing uh, that is not good yeah, it's just not good <laughs> okay so and then the end of that there's concern so people around are going to realize this is a concerning thing Trump doesn't have a chance y'all there's no way he's here until November there's no way I don't know how but I'm telling you there's no way because there's too much concern about the anger of the people I can tell you what this is and they're angry because they don't have money where's the food gonna come from how are they gonna pay their bills this is a legit okay Anybody higher up there needs to listen to this. This is a legit issue, and we are all in it. We are all in this issue. Yeah, your house, your home. You're worried about everything, your money, your income. Something new. Now, it's not something small because it doesn't feel small well, nothing in here is feeling really small y'all something new that's coming oh and here we go again message of concern you keep seeing all of this concern and this is all from the beginning of April to the end of April okay again message of concern it, and it's the people the people need help you they got to open their eyes and see that the people, the people need help. It's very simple. The people need help. Privileged lady. This is not about a particular person. It's more about a particular situation. My feeling is, oh, and it makes perfect sense. If you are having to do without, the last thing you're going to want to see is these people with privileges telling you, you know, just hang in there, it'll be all right. I, I, I actually feel that. And that's not a good situation either. So privileged people need not tell everybody else how to suck it up and just you know deal with it mature man what's well, Trump courtship so again friends of his companies of his that's what he's courting he's not thinking about the ordinary everyday people who are just for God's sake trying to get by pay attention to them somebody needs to pay attention to us because really it's us and I feel it I get you this is just not right Jesus so the family room it's probably about privileges and the family room so privileges in the family that are secret okay about their great fortune yeah marriage now this I'm I don't know why this is coming across to me um, <laughs> but it's like <laughs> I 
money's being hidden with or in marriages. Y'all, I know nothing about money. I have never in my life been wealthy enough to have lawyers put my... I, I don't know. I don't know. But something about marriages. And that's okay. I, you know, I'm fine with not being one of them <laughs> rich people. <laughs> oh, change. Okay. Okay, so we have the family secrets. See, this is the hard part when I'm trying to figure out what this change is and when it's happening. Because there's also the journey. So, and it's because of a mature woman. Oh, Nancy. Yeah. Nancy's got something. And it changes everything. That's what it's telling me. Okay. And it would have something to do. And she's going to court with it. It's going to court. With the wealthy man. Let me do this. Wealthy men. Because this is not just Trump. Oh. These are wealthy men. Wealthy. Wealthy. Wealthy men. It's not just Trump. I wish I could be more precise. But. Toil and labor. Now this is over the hard work. I'm wondering y'all. If it's talking about. The wealthy not seeing the the hard work, the normal everyday working people and what they're doing and they're just going on with their privileges but something happens that changes everything and and Nancy is on it so it has to have something to do with taking this, these because it's not just these wealthy men to court okay so I'm at the bottom there. I think I'm going to stop there. I don't want the video to be too long because then it's taking forever for it to, to load. And then we will pick up row three and go forward to May. And then we kind of start to put it all together and maybe we'll see y'all. If you see something or, you know, I'm saying something that you don't, you know, you think is something else, you know, let me know because it could have more than one meaning. Kind of like the wealthy man. I started to say this is, but I realized it wasn't. I got the feeling, no, wealthy men, there's more involved. And um, there's going to be a problem there. But anyway, I'm going to leave this here. I know it's hard, y'all. Please um, take good care of yourselves. Bless each other. Love each other. Let's support each other. Um, and stay positive. Please the Senate and the House. Show the people kindness. And if those people are still in cages. Get them out and get them in a hotel room. Show some dignity. And then show us. So that we can see and be proud. Of our government again. Okay. I love y'all. Stay positive. Until the next time friends. Thanks. Which will be tomorrow. I'll come back tomorrow and. We'll dig in this some more. Till the next time.